The CBS 330 game uh, in the SEC is number seven Ole Miss at LSU. This line's been bouncing around. The last I saw LSU is a one and a half point favorite, which is curious considering that LSU is unranked. And like I said, Ole Miss is undefeated and number seven. Um, yeah, I've, but it's funny, Ole Miss, like I said, they're, they're undefeated, but LSU has been in the headlines, it seems like, more than the Rebels this year, even with Mr. Headline, Lane Giffen, at the controls, you know. But it's it's about to get real for the Rebs, you know. They got this week, they got Texas A&M, they got Alabama, they got Arkansas, and they have Mississippi State. So it's, it's hard to believe they're going to make it through that unscathed. Um, and even this week, like I said, they're underdogs uh, against LSU, but uh, do you agree with that line? Don't you think the Rebels should be at least favored? I thought it, moved, it was moving down a little bit. I, I definitely think they should be favored. They have the rushing attack. They've done all those things you've said with Lane Kiffin. They've quietly gone about their business and have an mm-hmm. undefeated team. Show more consistency at the quarterback position than LSU has. LSU's been up and down, which, again, you've written about this, Bill, that first-year coaches, that's going to happen. So, you know, the peaks and valleys with Brian Kelly are very real. Um Fun game, though. I mean, this is one that if you're an Ole Miss, like we, I was saying on yesterday's podcast, that I think they have a very real opportunity to beat Alabama this year. But it won't matter if they can't get there undefeated because they're the, the one undebe- unbeaten SEC team that it would be easiest to discard if they lose. Mm-hmm. Be like, oh, no, that's Ole Miss. They lost. Get get them out of here. But I, I, I like them. I like their chances on the road, and it should be a fun game. Yeah, Jaden Daniels has been a little bit of a wild card at quarterback for LSU. He's capable of being, you know, very good like he was against Florida. And then he's capable of struggling like he has a few times, Tennessee game. Um, so you don't, you don't know what you're going to get. It's uh, That would be a stay away for me as far as right. trying to pick a winner. Um,